He's not. Oh, like I said, it is my honor and privilege to introduce the Speaker of the House, <laughs> Nancy Pelosi. That's it. <laughs> It's my honor to stand in for Jonah Goose. <laughs> I thank all of our freshmen, every single one of them, uh, for the message they delivered on the campaign trail, for the determination they have brought to the Congress of the United States. We are so excited today, as I think you can detect. In this cold day on the outside, we will go inside where the political climate will be much warmer for the American people because of the action that we will take today. We're thrilled to be here again on the steps of the Capitol, waving our flags with this outstanding freshman class in a show of great unity. When our freshmen took the oath, they made a difference, ensuring that the priorities of their communities would be the priorities of the Congress. Now, today, we're honoring the people's trust as we pass our transformative HR1 for the For the People Act. As has been said, <clears throat> excuse me, HR1 restores the people's faith that government works for the public interest, the people's interest, not the special interest. That faith, that confidence is a treasure is fundamental to a democracy that people believe, they believe uh, that actions taken here will be in their interest. That is what this legislation will help to restore. It ends the dominance of big, dark, special interest money in politics, and it empowers small donors and the grassroots. Uh, it ensures clean, fair elections and fighting vote and fights voter suppression. It cleans up corruption, returning integrity to Washington, D.C. Let us be very clear. This is a fight that we're taking a vote on today. But it is a fight we will not end until we win it, because it is a very fight for the Constitution. It honors the vision of our founders, gives hope to the American people that their interests are served. And so when we break the grip of special interest and put the people back in the, the power, back in the hands of the people. Let me salute our colleague John Lewis, and we'll hear from him on the floor shortly, uh, for the fight that he made for expanding the opportunities for voting in our country. We're all in his debt. But not only the fight he made then, the sacrifices he and so many others made, but also the brilliance that he has brought to this legislation. Uh, in, in the form of provisions to end voter suppression, which exists in our country, so sadly. And let us thank John Sarbanes. He had a vision. He had a vision. He has a vision that honors, again, the vision of our founders about a democracy. He knows his subject very well and therefore had a plan, a strategic plan, to take us to today. And he are, in the course of the campaigns, the freshmen connected with the American people who told them that they wanted their voices to be heard, what great messengers our freshman class, the messengers they are, uh, to the Congress for the people. So this is, in our view, an historic day, a pivotal day, a day that will make a difference as we go forward. And to those, as Mr. Phillips, Congressman Phillips said, if it, yes, it is a power grab, a power grab on behalf of the people. But let us look to the Senate and say, when we pass this bill, it's not just what happens on this floor. It's the message it sends to the American people. Our inside maneuvering will have succeeded today because of the outside mobilization of the American people for the people. So the Senate, as you receive this bill, you will also be receiving uh, the uh, aspirations, the mobilizations, the persistence, the relentlessness of the American people to have government work for them, for the people. So this is a fight we're engaged in. We are not going to end it until we win. And we can save a lot of time 
by the Senate just agreeing to the uh, for the people agenda. Thank you. Let's hear it for the freshman class and all the, the difference they are making for the people. Has our friend Jonah Goose gotten here? Well, Jonah Goose, we'll hear from him on the floor of the house. There we go. <laughs> but so many voices from the freshman class. It's pretty exciting. Let's get down. Let's go to the floor. Take the vote. Send it to the Senate soon to have a, and hopefully to have a path uh, to the president's desk again for the people. Let us wave our flag. Yay!